Hey everyone, today I'm going to talk about the unexpected benefits of board games. Now board games, there are some known benefits of it. Like how people come together and enjoy a certain activity. Like a lot of other games. You can have your family, your siblings, your cousins. A few competitions between two very very competitive people all coming together and join this intense games like chess or checkers or even Monopoly. Or a more of friendly family game like Scrabble. But there are a few unexpected benefits of these very board games. These board games in one way is an abstraction of the real world. Now for example when we play chess we use strategies to defeat the other player. It's only a two player game. And it's definitely does not capture the nuance of the entire world and the life we are going to live in it. But to fill this idea in the minds of people playing it, that we need to form a strategy, that we need to consciously plan something to move ahead so that we can have the maximum benefit. This idea, it comes from playing chess or playing checkers. Now, there are more luck games like Ludo, which are just fun, but they still teach people to do more to be more and it increases our mental ability which is very known by such games and the idea of strategy comes in and for scrabble our vocabulary increases now every time a person plays scrabble they can have more going on in their minds about words than any other things and that is why we need to play board games to enlist in the children's mind this idea of how the real world is going to be just to have that conceptual idea